covering the week's top tech stories with a slight Linux bias. While we're still waiting for the mainstream transition to 5G, Samsung is already beginning to discuss 6G, which the company expects to be commercialized as early as 2028. In a white paper published Tuesday, Samsung has said it expects the International Telecommunication Union to begin working on 6G in 2021. The amount of time and work dedicated to developing each generation of networking has shortened as time passes. Samsung said in the white paper that the company expects the earliest commercialized date for 6G to be 2028. It also states its belief that mass commercialization will or could occur by 2030. Samsung believes 6G will equally serve humans and machines as the main users. 6G will be will reign in an era of advanced services for truly immersive extended reality, high fidelity mobile hologram and digital replica. 6G's performance requirements much must reach a peak data rate of 1000 gigabits per second and air latency of fewer than 100 microseconds. For comparison's sake, that's 50 times the peak data rate of 5G and one-tenth the latency. The company has identified the three major pillars and requirements that will make up 6G. In order to fully realize 6G, performance, architectural, and trustworthiness requirements must be met. 5G was mainly focused around increased performance. Samsung's white paper notes that 6G architectural and performance requirements will overcome hurdles made by the limited computational capacities of mobile devices. Trustworthiness will address privacy and security concerns.